aspettare, può ascoltare con questo, comunque arrivano le cuffiettine come lei preferisce adesso le facciamo. Meglio le Buongiorno. Good morning. Welcome, warmly welcome to all of you who are here today. There are over 80 people coming from Japan for this uh, presentation of Keizuke Honda, who is the first Japanese uh, player who will wear AC Milan jersey in over 100 uh, years of history of our club. Uh, for the first uh, time, a Japanese uh, player will wear the number 10 jersey, very important uh, jersey, who was worn by Rivera, Ruth Gullit, uh, and great champions like uh, Savicevic, uh, Boban, uh, Rui Costa, Clarence Seedorf, uh, and then Prince Boateng. When Kevin Prince Boateng left at the end of August, uh, so we started uh, actually following uh, Keizuke, and uh, we thought to keep this number 10 jersey for him because he really wanted this uh, jersey. And there is a very nice uh, story about uh, Keizuke when he was a boy and he was dreaming about becoming an AC Milan player wearing uh, number 10 jersey. And so we really wanted uh, then this dream to come true for him. So Yokozo Onda, is it correct to say this in Japanese uh, to say welcome, so I will have to try now to learn some Japanese. Uh, and before questions and answers, uh, we will show you a video clip. And thank you again for being here.
Eccoci pronti. So now we are ready for all your questions. Good morning from Milano Channel. I wanted to ask to Keizuke Honda, how has it been uh, these uh, first uh, uh, days uh, you have already come to San Siro Stadium, as we saw in the clip, you have been to Milanello. What is your feeling? Uh, what about uh, your dream as a young boy? So your first feelings. Yes, I did. I'm so happy. And what about the meaning of number 10 jersey? Yeah. Um, when I know that one, my dream come true. When I was 12, I wrote, I, one day I wanted to pray Year, and I wanted to put number 10. So I really, really for hungry to come here and put number 10. So I'm, I was so happy when I know. Yeah, I, at first I would say uh, who care of my transfer, especially Mr. Gariani and uh, Mr. Gandini and my brother and at all yeah so i really want to show who i am on the pitch so i just uh, look at the video it looks uh, end of my career here <laughs> yeah but still beginning just to start from today Uh, will you start then uh, already with Sassuolo, according to you? Will you play against Sassuolo? Uh, I don't know yet. Because uh, I don't play for a month. And I know AC Milan is a big club, so I have to prepare well for the game. I think it's still right in the time. E poi vorrei aggiungere una cosa. I also would like to add, uh, we have been uh, to Japan, uh, we have uh, been uh, six times in a row in Japan, we are the only football club, and uh, actually um, I understand why sometimes we lost uh, because of a jet lag effect, and when we won 4-2 with Boca Juniors, uh, we understood uh, that uh, uh, the fourth, the fifth, and sixth, and seventh day after arriving, there is a jet lag effect. I am not a coach, I am not a doctor, but for sure, Keizuke needs some time. He arrived uh, Saturday night, uh, now four days have passed, uh, so you need uh, a little bit of training, but you have to wait for this uh, jet lag effect to disappear. We have started this uh, because uh, we understood uh, that uh, if um, we arrived there just uh, six days before the match, uh, performances were not very good. Uh, so I'm not a coach, I'm not a doctor, I'm just uh, a CEO, but I think uh, we must be cautious. Uh, we need some time, uh, the life is longer, contract will last at least uh, three years and a half. Uh, so apart from the month that he has not been playing, uh, we have to wait for this uh, jet lag to disappear. It is kind of a wave. Uh, so sorry uh, for uh, making uh, this uh, actually this uh, break into his uh, speech. I wanted to specify this, but for sure when he will play, he will be in the best condition possible. 
Good morning, welcome from Sky Sport. Why AC Milan? Why was this your dream? There were also other clubs like Barcelona. And I also would like to ask you, what is uh, the AC Milan player you uh, consider as uh, an example? And what would you like to win in your football career? want to come here so at first I want to become champion here and after that I'm thinking about Champions League You asked also about AC Milan player in the past uh, uh, to whom you refer you consider as a, an example, AC Milan player of the past. I know all players because uh, when I was young, I watched the TV every week, and the Serie A is most famous league in Japan that at the moment. So I cannot say one player. I I. I like many players. I have many favorite players here. Carlo Pelagatti from Mediaset. I have been uh, following you uh, since uh, you were in uh, CSKA Moscow, but I think that when you played in Confederations uh, Cup and in the last uh, matches of uh, CSKA uh, Moscow, is uh, a much stronger player. So now you are much stronger. You continue to grow and develop. And what else would you like to uh, gain uh, here in Italy? not only under an emotional point of view but also technically so you have developed you have grown as a player since you started uh, with CSK Moscow and now in AC Milan how much would you like to grow what would you like to change in your playing style you, you expect a lot so I know I have to show and I have to you satisfied. I think I have to make many goals, many assists. I will do my best, and uh, I will give some special things for the team. I will do my best. from Rice Sport. You are coming in a special uh, moment uh, for AC Milan. Uh, uh, AC Milan uh, is not in a very good uh, standing, uh, so also there is a risk for Champions League. Uh, so what can you give to this AC Milan team in order to uh, win more and grow in the ranking? Yeah, I said I just uh, need to score and assist and defense. Everything I have to do, what I can do. Uh, well, but I think uh, that the team is not so bad. I just watched the uh, game two days ago. I feel good. If I play there, uh, I have many images. Uh, how to play with them. Probably we can improve a lot. Uh, welcome in Milan. One question. What is uh, 
the role of your arrival in AC Milan in your professional career and in your private life. What is the importance of being here in, uh, with AC Milan for your professional life and personal life? Yeah, I, I said many interviews uh, about this question. Uh, I, for me, I just uh, I need a football. I don't mind which, which city I live in. I just need to uh, win the game and training hard and good rest. That is important for my life. And I know the club helped me a lot from now. Good morning. A question for uh, Honda. I would like to know if uh, there is a teammate with whom uh, you really would like uh, to play and if there is a, a favorite position for you in which you would like to play. Um, I can play every position, but if I can choose, I want to play behind the striker. I think this is my position. What do you mean? You, uh, you are uh, you are attitude like uh, concentrate to football yes. and think and think and think and find your result. Yeah. Is that you are a native character or you are are you you forced uh, by your mind? I think I think that both. Mm -hmm. I I have this character from the I born, but on the other hand, I try to become like this character. So I think both. Gazzetta dello Sport. Uh, we know that you are a celebrity in Japan, and so uh, what is your impression, the fact that you have been uh, actually treated as a Beckham uh, in uh, the media situation uh, because all the world uh, is watching you? What is the impression about this? Is it, uh, are you nervous about this? I I know my job. I have to play well on the pitch. But I like fashion. I like uh, uh, to give dream and brave to the children. So I try to behave how is professional football players. Yeah. This is uh, who I am. What are the differences between uh, Italian football, Russian football, and Japanese football? Which will be the main uh, difficulties you will have uh, playing uh, in Italy? Mm. I think Italian football is more tactics and defensive. So I, my quality is attack, but I have to help the defense players 
and I have to know the manager, what manager want to do for 90 minutes. Yeah, I understand all. TV in Spata, Sinakizaki. Uh, I want to ask a difficult question. How many club did you? Uh, how many this club did you offer in New England? So why did you choose AC Milan? No, that's easy. I just ask my little Honda in my heart. Which club do you want to play? I asked. Yeah, he answered. I want to play AC Milan. That is uh, the story when I decided. From Giornale Milano, I would like to ask you why do you always wear eyeglasses? Uh, do you have a problem with uh, your uh, uh, sight? You can't see very well because you wear eyeglasses all the time. More than 1,000. <laughs> but I always answer, this is just fashion. Yeah, so I don't mind sound or the crowd. The, yeah, weather. I don't mind my weather. Yes. Another thing. Can you explain to us uh, what is the samurai spirit? Uh, Many Japanese uh, colleagues uh, said that uh, Honda will uh, bring to AC Milan the samurai spirit. Can you explain to us what it is? I never meet a samurai. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know that is true, but I think Japanese man uh, is uh, never give up and strong mentality, and we had good discipline. So I think I had two. So just I want to show that spirit on the pitch. We uh, saw you at the stadium and next to Galliani and the reaction of Galliani at uh, a goal scored was uh, very excited, whereas you, kept, you kept calm, you were very quiet. Why you didn't react so strongly to a goal as Galliani did? Mm. Because uh, still beginning. I am not satisfied. I have to training hard from here from today, and uh, I have to make result myself for the team. So I I was happy uh, we won the last game, but that is a difficult different different matter. It's my my matter. I was happy. We are used uh, to Nagato, who is uh, very nice. Uh, so what is the nicest, uh, most, uh, uh, the nicest thing he told you about your choice uh, coming to Milan? Nagatomo, yes. Uh, Italian league and Italian fans knows football. So if you play bad, they shit you immediately. <laughs> so I care, I remember, I have to play well, keep playing. That is my task.
how did you leave uh, the months uh, uh, from August to December uh, during which uh, Galliani contacted you, uh, wanted to bring you to IC Milan? What uh, was in your mind? What did you think during this period? No, it was not difficult. I just, I was free as of Sheska Moscow. And of course, I wanted to, to come here last uh, August, but I just played for the X team and just I focused for my condition. And I believe January I can come here. I wanted to ask you, this is uh, the World Cup year. Uh, what is uh, the meaning of this uh, uh, World Cup for you? And during the Confederations Cup, uh, you played against uh, Italy. What do you remember from that uh, match? And what do you think you can do in uh, the World Cup? Confederations Cup. So I want to try to win against Italy in World Cup. At first, we have to throw out from my group. So that is my target. I want to play against Italy in World Cup. Uh, what did Zaccheroni uh, told you about uh, AC Milan, about uh, Italy, about uh, how to leave this new adventure in Italy? Uh, Milan is really top club in Italy, and yeah, he said everything top. Uh, but still, you just beginning, so you have to play well and just keep it. That is his advice. You said that the city is not so important for you. But what about uh, these uh, first uh, days uh, in Milan? Uh, where are you thinking you are going to live? Uh, downtown or near the uh, San Siro Stadium? So your first feelings about uh, the city of Milan? All building totally different in Japan. Yeah. I went to some uh, restaurant and food also very delicious. I like it. I want to visit some good place and I want to go to some restaurant. Yeah, if you know, let me know, please. A question uh, for uh, uh, Galliani and for Onda. Uh, to Galliani, I ask, uh, uh, were you expecting uh, Kaká, Balotelli, Onda? Was it in the plans of AC Milan? And the question to Onda, what is your opinion about uh, Kaká and uh, Balotelli? Yeah, I dare, uh, I think, uh, number one players in the world. And I, I am glad to play with them. I want to learn a lot. I think I can learn a lot from them. And we, if we play good, we can become champion, uh, uh, not about not this year, but next year. Uh, 
per quanto mi riguarda Balotelli. Uh, for Balotelli, we started the negotiations uh, one year ago. We were in full negotiating uh, in, uh, with Manchester City. And I've never forgot uh, Kaká and uh, about Honda. We started uh, thinking about uh, uh, what, can, what we could do, and uh, Bronzetti knows this very well. Uh. Uh, so uh, a negotiation that started uh, one year ago for Balotelli, a player that we never forgot for Kaká, and Onda, another player uh, for whom we also started uh, negotiations, uh, and we started thinking about him some time ago. So now we need to do some pictures. Uh. Are there any other questions? Uh, so everything went well. So what shall we do now? Shall we make some pictures and then we start again? And I would like to know how this idea about the special uh, logo of Onda, that was not uh, my idea. Who had this idea for this uh, number 10 uh, logo? Uh, special projects uh, department uh, from AC Milan. Uh, this uh, 10 number is very nice. Okay, thank you very much. Tutta la stampa giapponese in zona mista, per favore.